Hey guys, I really don't know if this is gonna work, but I had here a big problem. Um, I have just overclocked my PlayStation 3 to the maximum, like you can see, I got here just everywhere pixel errors, and it's just here now. It stucks somehow, but I can see it's still working. If I got luck, this is gonna work somehow. I don't know, but I'm trying it. Um, I have just got the PlayStation in the fridge, and uh, then I was able to get, let's say, here inside. And now, um, yeah, I need to wait. This is really badass. I hope that somehow it's going to work. If not, I'm going to put it again in the fridge. This is, um, yeah, badass. But I hope for the best somehow. I'm going to keep trying it hard because if this happens, it's um, nearly game over, you know. Oh man, let's try for the best. So I just wanted to tell you this fridge option. NC. Yeah guys, um, I have put it um, on the fridge, uh, not the normal fridge, how it calls, with the ice, you know, so um, I have put it on about half hour in the ice fridge, <laughs> I hope it calls like that, and I was able to install the rest up to 40%, but then I had again some pixel errors and it was just not working here. So at last I have tried everything, um, I had it also for about one hour in the ice fridge and it was not really working because it was just too hardcore. I have sadly take here a firmware which the overclock was just too high and now I'm just trying to get here a backup like you can see and um, yeah, it's reading the chip, I hope you can see that. So it was not planned this video, um, but yeah, you already know me. I will not give up this wonderful PlayStation here. And now it's reading um, the NAND Zero. And after that, I need to read this NAND chip here, which is NAND One. Let me just turn on the light. And here you can see now it's all working. Yeah, I need to wait now because this is going to take about 20 minutes. And uh, then I need to read the other NAND chip and later so we gonna um, make it possible to, let's say, install a newer custom firmware over the USB, um, yeah, let's say, port here. This gonna work directly. You can take a look on my YouTube channel, PS3 NAND Downgrade NSC. Just search it about, yeah, PS3 NAND Downgrade by NSC. And you're gonna find all this video, all these tutorials, and it's still amazing because otherwise this will be very hard for some people outside there. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying that all. Then let's go for NUNT1 and then, uh, yeah, let's prepare all this stuff and I hope for the best. Okay guys, so um, like on my video, you maybe still have this folder, which is the NUNTWAY toolpack. Um, you just go to the folder NUNTWAY, yeah, here. And there you see now a folder which calls differential flashing. This folder here needs to be empty, okay? Because after you have, let's say, patched it, it will create you two new text files. And these are these ones here, one and two, okay? Flash zero is, let's say, NUNT zero, flash one, NUNT one. These two files, after you have 
let's say, patch it all and done it all, just like on my video, it will create you these two files here inside. Okay, so. And there, these two files you need to cut out. Yeah, just cut it or copy, but it's better to cut it. Okay, so this is not just in German, but you don't care. Cut it and move it out to the folder Nantway. Okay, here. <coughs> PlayStation goes off. Yeah, it sounds good. So, uh, then you just put it here inside. I had now a problem. Um, I had these two files here from another PlayStation 3 Fat Edition. <laughs> and that's why it was not working. Um, this time I have just about 34 blocks. And you can see here. Um, you can see here the blocks. You can also count it yourself. See, one. Then you go down, two, three, four, five, na, 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 34. Okay, so I had here 34, block, uh, 34 blocks on uh, NAND0 and 34 on NAND1. And it needs always to be 34, 34, or let's say 49, 49, doesn't matter. But it needs always to be the same on, on flash 0 and flash 1, okay? But this was my problem. Um, I had just 34 let's say blocks but the file was with 49 <laughs> and this caused me of course a yellow light of that now i'm ready i need now um to set again my uh, tensi as a dongle and i'm right now in factory service mode and later um <clears throat> i need now step two to get off factory service mode okay so i'm gonna just put this all now in my usb pen and then i'm gonna keep recording it so now i have uh, just the uh, factory service mode step two inside i have turned it on you don't need the tensi anymore just get it in with um yeah let's say factory service mode step two turn it on wait a little bit then you're gonna see that it's gonna read something and then it's gonna just shut off again now Take it off here, wait, <clears throat> turn it off, okay, wait a little bit. Now let's plug in again the HDMI cable <clears throat> and let's hope for the best right now. <laughs> so this was how to fix uh, overclocked custom firmware, oh my god. So here we go and let's hope for the best. <clears throat> I hope it will. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come, come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, please, without text. Yeah, I got no texture problems anymore. That's great. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm so happy <laughs> because I'm happy. Yeah. I nearly wanted to give up <laughs> because I read on the internet you can't forget it it's gonna not be possible to uh, revive it again and I have really read a lot of shit on the internet and I just thought myself no 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 it cannot be but I had here a very big um, overclock I think it was about 800 950 or something like that <laughs> so this was <laughs> at last yeah it was my fault <clears throat> but I just wanted to try because I started somewhere at 600 750 okay I'm talking here about the overclock and I ended up with <laughs> 800 950 <laughs> this was one too much but uh, that's why you should always go small steps and small overclocks so there you're gonna yeah, be able to do it better but I had really just too much and I had here a lot of texture and pixel errors and yeah the PlayStation like that of course was freezing but I have done it right now I'm so happy and here again Tansy for let's say NAND consoles you're gonna need a Tansy Tansy uh, 2 plus plus I think uh, you can see all still on my YouTube videos uh, if you have some questions, let me know, because I found uh, a small thing that I could probably do better. But I have now show you on this video right now what I have myself um, what I have myself made it wrong. Okay, and this was the two files that I have shown you already 
all the rest on the YouTube video is just awesome and nice to do. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. So this is the way you can go. I'm so happy. And um, yeah, now I got here, of course, that you know, Rogero Downgrader. Yeah, if you have a problem on your PlayStation, you always go for Rogero Downgrader. Okay, so this is the best you can do. Yeah, and then you can just uh, keep going and doing the stuff just like I always um, yeah, recommend you on my YouTube channel <clears throat> or let's say on my videos. And yeah, I'm, I'm ready for now. I'm, I'm so happy. Let's not just turn it off. <laughs> I'm so happy. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, guys, I'm going to now just pull it all together and I'm going to do it nice and clean. And then I need to install all the firmware again. And uh, I can recommend you if you want to overclock your PlayStation, do on the maximum 600, 7, 750. Um, I have tried a lot and um, in my eyes, the um, custom firmware 600, 750 is just okay. Okay, so you don't need anything else. It's a PlayStation 3, it's not a computer and it's even, it's better than nothing and you can use it 24 seven, you know, so you can use it all days and without problems and all the others that I have tested, I have noticed that the PlayStation gets a, a little bit hotter than um yeah, standard or let's say then original. <clears throat> so yeah, you can do it if you have a great cooling, really awesome cooling, just like this one. Um, I have tested a lot, but <laughs> 800, 950 was just too much. <laughs> okay, guys, see you soon. That was all for me. And a see in the place to be. Peace. And see in the place to be. And see.